Ten years ago, Typhoon Ramerson etched its name into history, a Category 5 storm cutting through the South China Sea, a rare beast in these waters. Its winds tore through Hainan, leaving behind destruction, resilience and a billion dollar reminder of the ocean's quiet unpredictability. Ramerson was one of a kind, or so it seemed, but the Pacific never truly rests. It watches, it waits, and every so often, it speaks a name no one is prepared to hear. Not every storm is remembered, but some names, like Ramerson, never fade, and some are destined to rise. But when will such a storm come? Beginning now is the 2024 Western Pacific Typhoon Season animation by Force 13. Pagkatapos ka ba rin ang kalupaan ng Luzon na yung naging isang typhoon na si Agron International na yung Evinia at magnanthoon na sa Polio Island at nakalabas na. Ang kasalukoy ng posisyon nito ay 14.9 degrees north at 122.2 degrees east. that we were talking about, uh, Jack sh shared this really interesting uh, graphic audio. Uh, Here it uh, is. Features Tom, uh, Shirley 1960, uh, Mary 1965, Sarah of 1989, Polly 1992, Haitang in uh, 2005, Kosa and Sinlaku in 2007. And they all lose. It is very it's, it's spookily consistent really, isn't it? You sort of are, are expecting to see Gaby turn away from land in a moment. Could it be? This is a typhoon warning for the entire of Taiwan, Ishigaki and Yonaguni. Typh a yellow typhoon warning anywhere south from Wenzhou to Guangzhou, uh, off, off, the, off the coast of China. And oddly an orange typhoon warning for Wenzhou.
được dự báo của tổ chức Mỹ JTWC, cơn bão sẽ đổ bộ ở Đông Bắc Bộ, sau đó nó chạy vào Tây Bắc, xong đi qua biên giới của Việt Nam với Đà Lạt. Và lúc bão đi qua có thể mưa lớn và mấy khu vực sẽ bị ngập, lụt, sạt lở đất, và đất nhân có gió mạnh. This system has already been very close to beating records, or beating some records in fact. So, I mean, I guess you could say possibility of it making a category four landfall in Vietnam. Rapidly intensifying typhoon now going for the lose on straight. So Krathon approaching super typhoon status as it nears Taiwan today. Um, a very intense storm right now. 140 miles per hour we're going with 932 millibars, moving northwest at 8 miles per hour. So you know there's been some storms who have been able to survive over Taiwan, and then there's some storms who have just been completely obliterated by it. You never really can tell until you actually have that happen. And that's the hard part of this kind of forecast. Now the question is, where does Krathon go after this? Super Typhoon Usagi is currently heading towards the Philippines. We have it as a Category 5 in our analysis right now. Typhoon Man Yi is going all the way. It's now a Category 5 Super Typhoon on the San Francisco Hurricane Wind Scale.
ultimate fan today.